Hello everyone, I'm Ryan and in this video I'm going to show you a very simple trick that can save you quite a few keystrokes when you're working with Inkscape. And uh, so let's start. Uh, what I have here is four rectangles with a fill and, and an, a yellow border. And what I have here on the right is a small circle with a green fill and a gray color border. What I want to do is I want to you know, take all these styles from this circle and apply them to all these four rectangles. There are many ways in which you can actually do this. Uh, the sim if you, you know, the simplest way to actually do this would be to, you know, just select this circle, you know, copy the color, the fill color, select all of these, and then uh, go back here, right click, and then paste color. That's one way to do it, and then you you'd also repeat the same action for your uh, for the border. So you select the circle, copy the color of the border, go here, select all of these, paste the color of the border. But that's a little more keystrokes than the easiest technique. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you the other way to do it, which is far more simpler. Uh, you select this circle. Uh, just press Control C on the Mac. Control C, yes. Uh, and then you select all of these four rectangles, and then you press Control Shift and V. And what it does is it copies all the styles from this element to the elements of of your destination. Uh, this also works for text. For example, if you have uh, some text here, which is which you see here, this is in a different font. It's in sans and it, is, it has a font size of 40. And if you look at this text, this is Apple Gothic and it has a font size of 20. So if I want to this, uh, let's change this text on the top to look like the text at the bottom. So I can just press Control C on the Mac, Control C, uh, and select this text and Control Shift B. So that only copies the style of this text to the other, uh, to the, your destination. Uh, so you copy the same way, the way you copy stuff, Control C, and when you're pasting it, you just do Control Shift V. If you're having trouble copying stuff on the Mac, there is one thing that you might want to do. You want to click on X11, uh, go to your preferences, and you want to uncheck this box. Uh, this messes around with the way your keyboard, uh, your the keyboard, the clipboard is shared between your uh, X11 and the Mac, and it also causes other issues. Like, uh, if you were to copy this vector image from this document to another Inkscape document, it would just paste a, a screenshot of that of the selection, which is not what you want. So. If that's the issue that you're facing, if you're, if, you're, if you're trying to copy a vector into a different document and you are actually you end up pasting a screenshot of that selection, you would want to sorry, uh, you would want to actually go here, go to preferences and uncheck this box. Uh, I think that's it for this short video. I hope you learned something today. Thank you.